This is the ACC Digital Network, brought to you by Ruby Tuesday, quarterfinal round of the ACC Women's Tournament from Greensboro. In the books, and those semifinal matchups are set. North Carolina State, winners of 25 games this year, will take on Notre Dame and its perfect 30-0 record after its win against Florida State today in the semifinals. The other matchup features, features Duke and North Carolina. That is the semifinal matchup. That is a rematch of the championship game from a season ago. Now, these two teams met twice during the regular season, and North Carolina won both of those games. So with that in mind, for more on that semifinal matchup, we send it to Mike Hogwood and Debbie Antonelli. All right, Tom, thanks a lot. And, you know, it's always tough when you play a rival, but especially to beat them for the third time in one season. It's not going to be easy, but uh, I love this matchup. What a great setting, Mike. Are you yeah. kidding me? We get the ACC semifinal Saturday. you got Duke and North Carolina playing against each other. I mean, it's terrific. These two have played for most of the titles here in Greensboro, uh, either separate or against each other. So now they're playing in the semis. You know, it always goes through one or the other to win. But I, I thought Duke today showed that they have tremendous offensive balance, not only on the defensive end with their ability to block shots, but to share the ball and hit open shots. Philia Johnson at the end of the half. Elizabeth Williams, I thought, was dominant block to block, and Duke with 13 block shots set a tournament record. Haley Peters had 19 to lead Duke and had 16 in the second half. She had a great offensive game, and that kind of balance without playing with a point guard, and I'm calling it the lead guard yeah. now. Uh, I think Duke uh, has a, a really good chance to spread the floor and, and try to take a, advantage of that North Carolina pressure with some backdoor opportunity. Yeah, the firepower of Trisha Liston in there and Peters, as you said, with the double-double, and it does make Duke formidable. But, of course, they're the great freshman for North Carolina and Diamond to Shields. She's the X Factor. I've said all season no one can stop her. I don't think anybody can guard her, and I don't think Duke can guard her one-on-one. -on -one. And how they'll defend her in that matchup zone will be interesting. But Diamond took her game to the inside tonight. She inverted to the block. She scored with her back to the basket. She got the mid-range jump shot work, and she didn't settle for the three. She set up her ability to go inside by knocking down the first two baskets that she made were outside the arc. She's got great balance to her game, and she is a tough check for anybody, including anybody. Duke. Yeah, and she is so, so smooth, and offensive rebounding was also a big key for North Carolina in that game. Tom, we'll send it back to you. Debbie and Mike, thank you so much for your insights on that semifinal matchup. Duke in North Carolina, the two teams will meet for the third time this season. The winner is on to the championship game of the 2014 ACC Women's Tournament. This is the ACC Digital Network brought to you by Ruby Tuesday.